Good morning, traders. Well, we saw a risk on session led by uh, global banking support after the Swiss National Bank uh, gave a lifeline to Credit Suisse and 11 large US banks also teamed up to help First Republic Bank, one of the smaller banks that were looking like they're in a bit of trouble. Um, that banking support saw equities rally, all major US indexes finishing the green, the NASDAQ being the big winner as it has been all week really. Um, the ECB surprised with a 50 basis point hike. The market after the Credit Suisse problems, the market had been pricing in around 28 basis points. So. It, expecting a 25 but they've come out with a 50 but it was seen as a dovish hike with um, no forward guidance and, and the ECB basically saying they're going to take it meeting by meeting going forward. That was enough to get the euro rallying modestly above 106. Safe haven flows did unwind uh, with the US dollar weakening the Japanese yen. Gold holding steady, bonds were sold off um, on, on improved optimism on these, on these bailout talks. Now, Bitcoin uh, also tested the 25,000 level again. It was again rejected there. So it's a, it's a, it's a big level to watch. If it hasn't been able to get above and hold all week, so um, looking like a, a major resistance level for the for the crypto there. Uh, ec economic news, nothing pretty quiet night actually. We've got U.S. consumer sentiment, which would be the only one really worth watching. <laughs>